So my name is Arthur Noche. I'm a child life specialist for Miller Children's Women's Hospital in Long Beach. Um, what we do is kind of normalize the environment for the kids. So working with Avengers Initiative is definitely a plus, especially when we run our um, special programs and events for all of our patients, kids, just to feel like they're not in the hospital and they're not stuck there. And like, hospitals a really scary place. So you know, being able to see like superheroes and and um, you know like Star Wars people, like Star Wars characters, like it's always a good experience for them to, to be able to do that. So tell me, tell me um, wh where you found uh, Avengers Initiative and why are they such a unique group? So um, it's really embarrassing, but I, uh, I, I found them on Google. Um, we needed somebody, we needed like a group of cosplayers and, and um, characters to show up at one of our super siblings events to um, you know, to visit the siblings and kind of make them feel like they, they're loved and, and they, they're getting attention too when they haven't been um, getting the attention they need, um, especially with their brother or sister in the hospital. So I did a quick Google search and like they, they were the first ones that I found that I felt like connected with. Um, they were so nice. They, their response time was, was literally like within an hour and everything. Um, and um, they were the ones that never charged, you know? So I remember being embarrassed because I had to ask, I was like, how much is this gonna be, you know? And they're like, oh, we do this for free, you know? Um, there are a lot of like other characters and cosplay programs that um, they'll charge money for it. And I'm like, so then I remember talking to Mark and I was, I was asking him, I was like, how much is this gonna be? He was like, no, no, it's free. Like, you're doing us a favor, you know? Um, and that's what made them feel unique to me. Like, they were in it for, you know, just to make people's days. They weren't in it to make money or anything like that. It was um, what my, my department does. We, we do it for, you know, you know, for the kids and seeing the smiles on their faces and, and, and for their families as well. Talk about the events that, you got, that they participate with you. So I can name three right now. We did the Super Siblings events, which was for, um, you know, past and present um, patients, families, and siblings that they could um, hang out and, and kind of get all the attention for once. Um, and they loved it. We, that was like their first, that was the first time I reached out to Mark. Um, they made it really easy. They brought five or six different cosplayers and um, they were great with the kids. Um, we also did a May the 4th as well, um, but we did, that was during COVID, so that was, the, we had to actually film like a, a show for the kids to watch on their TVs in the hospital and kind of feel connected to all the characters, uh, the Star Wars characters, whether it was Luke or, or, or Stormtroopers or, um, or Darth Vader or anything. Um, and then our last one is our beach day, um, which is when kids actually get to leave their rooms and um, all meet up in like an auditorium in our hospital. And um, like we have different booths there that they could see. And then we did have um, Captain Marvel there. Um, last year um, our next one is actually in August um, I don't know if we I'm, I'm sure I'm sure Mark's gonna be showing up with um, some cosplayers for that day too but um, Beach Day is a really good really great day for for our department and everything just go over again why their association is so unique um, they're so unique because they're so easy to to talk to um, you know they're Sometimes I, I talk to people trying to get them into to volunteer, and they're like, oh, "Like it's, it's a business, you know." And as much as a business this is, and the Avengers Initiative are, um, they also are very down to earth and easy to talk with, and easy to plan out, um, plan everything with. Um, they know what uh, the hospital kind of expects from them. Um, they make my job easier because I'm the one who kind of handles the the groups whenever they come in to visit uh, the kids. Um, so they make my job easy because they they already know what to expect. Tell me what we what would you tell other hospitals? This is why you should use the Avengers Initiative. I would choose the Avengers Initiative over any other program for our hospital because they are just they make it so easy on hospital staff on the healthcare team. They they know about the HIPAA violations. They know not to ask um, the kids certain questions about. Um, what diagnosis they have because that stuff is really private and it makes my job a lot easier to like just let them let them be and let them meet the kids and and you know make their 
patient, make the patients and families just smile, you know, for a day because this, the hospital is a really scary setting, and um, just seeing some somebody they're familiar with, whether it's Iron Man or Captain America or like even stormtroopers, like they they love it when it's, they see something out of the ordinary, you know.